Uh, let's react to Spooderman Lotus, the fan film. Premiered 27th of October. Indiegogo. Spooderman. For it's. They uploaded the trailer in 4K when Sony couldn't for Morbius. And I don't even think the new uh, No Way Home trailer is uploaded in 4K. Somebody cares. Somebody cares. There's a weird lighting change there. Sorry. I'm going to be hypercritical of this child. Yeah, what was that? Did you see that? Is that supposed to imply that somebody turned the light on in that room, or is that like a weird rendering error? See it? See the lighting here, and then it gets brighter. Everybody's gonna hate me so much. Yeah, that's. I think that's a weird error that they can fix. But now that I pointed it out, the film will be better because they obviously they watch me, and I had did a voice crack, and I'm a child too. I've been yelling all day. <laughs> that's a cool shot. I like that the TV was actually in the eyeball. <laughs> Am I going to get copyright claim for this music? Hold on. Maybe not. It's original music. Or an actual cover of it. Okay, never mind. But still, I might not get uh, copyright claimed. Not affiliated with Marvel or Sony. Fan film... Wait, is this doesn't feel very 4K, but it's also an image within an image, so never mind. <laughs> He's looking at his iPad. <laughs> is that Gwen Stacy? What I'm concerned about here is, is like this looks nice. What's okay? What's the story behind this? Before I go any further, this is like shot by like a 19 year old or something. All right, let's see. Indiegogo. A non-profit psychological study of Peter Parker as he's confronted by the guilt of his past. They've already raised more than enough. They were tr looking for 33,000 Canadian dollars. They've raised 119,000 Canadian dollars. Um, so, like, somebody said... When somebody told me about this, they said it was, like, a kid that made this. Like, um... Can someone confirm this with me? They made like a 3D printing of a thing. Can somebody say anything about this? So I don't have to look it up. And provide like a source. All right, I'm going to look at their Kickstarter video. Oh, wait, the Kickstarter video is literally just the trailer that I'm watching. Well, let's see what else is on their channel then. I just I'm trying to understand the hype here. Twitter. Okay, here we go. Their Twitter says born August fifth, two thousand three. So they're like eighteen then, right? Nineteen. Yeah. Their tw that's what their Twitter says. Writer and director of Spider Man Lotus coming twenty twenty two. If you would like to fund the project. Okay. Um did I do math right? All right. Let's keep watching. Oops. Fuck. Sorry, I pressed the wrong button. Oh, my God. What just happened? I pressed a button on my... Sorry. Get out of here. Don't think of this as a goodbye tape. Think of it more as a checking in tape. Sorry? Don't think of this as a goodbye tape. All right, I'm going to turn the volume up for y'all a little bit. Because I'm having difficulty with this. Don't think of this as a goodbye something. Don't think of this as a goodbye tape. Goodbye tape. Think of it more as a checking in tape. A checking in tape. Let's go. Starring Dane DeHaan. As Spider Man. Moving on. 
So here I am. This looks remarkably well shot for a 19 year old. I hope it's not a scam. Um, also, I don't know if the narrative is necessarily going to be good just because it looks nice. Just checking in to say hi. I think I see the zipper. Yeah, that might have been a zipper. I don't know what that was. It looked awkward, whatever it was. And then I miss you. What I'm concerned about is like most people don't understand how manipulative music is and how manipulative trailers are. And I understand, yeah, this is not like a professionally, this isn't like a studio trailer or anything, but making a montage set to like some really sad, sentimental sounding music uh, and the implication in your brain of like, oh, I'm filling in the blanks of what I'm not seeing. Meanwhile, they're showing like only the best parts. Like, you know, I guess this is a trailer for something that doesn't even exist yet because they have an Indiegogo, but it's like they filmed the trailer. It's like they, they only filmed the trailer. So I wonder if these are actually shots from the finished product or if they just filmed a trailer that's, in the same tone as what they want to make? Like, I don't know. I miss you, Clint. Get better mixing. I can barely hear when they're saying things. <laughs> Whoever he thinks I am, I'm not. You've seen the headlines. Figure it out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, now that they're doing these things, it's not. It doesn't seem so amazing. And also, yeah, like I can barely hear the audio, the the voiceover. I'm not. You've seen the headlines. Figure it out. It needs to be mixed better. Like. This looks very, this looks kind of silly, actually. <laughs> now that it's going along, like, holy shit. It looked, like, really nice before. Like, maybe there's, like, a really good color corrector they sent it to. There were some, like, nice-looking shots. There were some decent-looking shots in here. But now it's starting to look kind of silly. I'm not. You've seen the headlines. Figure it out. The suit's well-made. For what it is. It looks better than the, the John Watts movies because it looks like it's actually taking place in the environment of the film. That little boy in there has looked up to you his entire life. Better fucking the mixing's terrible in this trailer. Holy shit. You are his hero. So please give him some. This looks sappy as fuck, but good on you, 19-year-old. I'm rooting for you. Good on you. We all lost something. I don't... The, the... These actresses look very strange. <laughs> I'm just saying. We all... They look like they're both wearing wigs. Are they not wearing... If these aren't wigs, then it's very weird looking. <laughs> we... Right? All lost. This is very strange. Lost something. But I think we gained something too. I mean, if people want to see something that's cheesy as fuck, which, I mean, based on box office numbers right now, it seems to be the case, then great. I'm rooting for this kid. Rooting for him. I will always be Spider Man. <laughs> the, 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 way, the way his hands, like, kind of touch the kid is really awkward. It's very strange. I will al yeah. always be Spider Man. Look at this. He, uh, yeah. <laughs> I want to. It's not like a real hug, it's like a camera hug. He doesn't want to get, like, too close to this kid that he just hired for the day, you know? 
Uh, you know, a real hug is like arms. Whatever, I'm judgy. Not because I want to. Is that Harry? Because I have to. Sorry, did he just mandate that kid? This is very cheese. This is incredibly cheese and really funny. This isn't going to be good. I mean, okay, hate me or whatever, but it's not going to be great. It looked like, damn, like the first few shots looked awesome. I was like, wow. Because I have to. But now it's just, I mean, it looks like what decently well shot. Like from a visual standpoint, it doesn't look like a really cheaply shot film. Like it looks like they're using a decent camera and they've got half decent lighting depending on the scene and like good color correction, I think. Wow, that's weird. Oh, that's not even from the... That's just from the movie or the game. They didn't even... Wait a minute. What's that shot? What? No, they... Okay, they made that. Some of that looks really weird. But I mean budget, I guess. Yeah, it might be Blender. You're right. I love you, Gwen Stacy. See, uh, he whispered, I love you, Stacy, but it's so quiet in the mix. I love you, Gwen Stacy. It's so quiet. How can you. You gotta mix that better. Boost. When you make the highlight, boost that part. You gotta boost that part, Salamancer. You gotta make it so that the audience can understand. I love you, Gwen Stacy. Lotus. More like POTUS. Got him, because all the presidents in America are stupid. Spider-Man. This is, I mean, Terribly mixed. Looks decent for what it is. I don't know what kind of privileges this child has. But good on him. Uh, rooting for him. This is one of the better looking fan film trailers I've seen, honestly. Um, you know, if we're going to judge fan film trailers with fan film trailers. This is one of the better ones. Looks cheesy as fuck. Bring on the hate. I'm a hater. Whatever. Sorry. But surprised this doesn't have more views, honestly. Seems right up the alley of people. Hey guys, it's December of 2021, so let's update the Patreon credits. My top patrons are Wholesome 100 Big Chunkus Lemonade Warrior, Big Well from Robust the Animated Movie, Charisma S, The Super One Player, Dwyer Tarantino, Jacob Arndt, Zachary Kane, Sam Joel, Cheat.exe, Gothic Sith, Mandel Bro, Kel Hunt, Wales, Bo the Doggo, Kai Butcher, Splat, Hoofy Doe, Ocean Machinery, and Malav Shah. Hope you enjoyed the video and happy holidays.